Today, I'm making an entree dish that I like to call Triple S Pad Thai. Triple S stands for sweet, sour, and spicy. Let's get started. All right, so first, I'm gonna start with the onions. So I'm gonna chop some onions. I have some uh, oil that is heating in the, in the pan right now. Uh, I'm gonna finely chop this, this uh, onion. I'm just gonna cook them for uh, a couple of minutes. I'll be using two garlic cloves um, for this recipe. I really like garlic, so I'm probably gonna add one more. I'll just finely chop the, uh, the garlic before adding it to the skillet. Stir the mixture. So while the onions and garlic are cooking, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on the uh, chicken breast. For this recipe, uh, I'm using two chicken breasts that I will cut into cubes. And now I'm going to add it to the pan. For seasoning, I'm uh, adding a pinch of salt. And uh, I'll also be adding some uh, black pepper. We'll let this cook for a few, more, a few more minutes. Now we can start working on the flavors one layer at a time. So the first layer we can start with is the sweet layer. For that, what I'm doing is I'm adding four tablespoons of peanut butter to a quarter cup water. one tablespoon of soy sauce. Whisk this mixture together. You want to whisk it until you get a smooth mixture. So that we have that. Mm, oh my god, this smells amazing. The second layer is going to be the spicy layer. For that, I have some Thai chili pepper. What you can do to reduce the hotness of the pepper is you can cut it and remove the seeds inside the pepper. And I'm doing that right now. And I highly recommend that you try a piece of the pepper that you, you, you bought before you put it in, into it the mixture, just to have an idea of how spicy it is, oh my, that is spicy. Okay, what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to give them a rough uh, chop before I add them to the chicken. There you go. Now it's time to work on the third S, which is sour. So for that, what I'm doing is I have lime here that I'm gonna cut in half. And all you need to do is just squeeze it. And in addition to the chicken, I will also be adding some shrimp. So this is, uh, pre-cooked shrimp and uh, I have about 20. For extra crunch, what I like to add to this pad thai is um, peanuts. Here I have unsalted uh, roasted peanuts that uh, I'm just going to give it a rough chop. Boiling water in a pot, and I'm going to be cooking the uh, the vermicellis in here for three minutes. But the last thing I'm going to add is cilantro. So I have here some fresh cilantro that I'm going to chop. I like to add that at the end, uh, just so that I don't overcook the cilantro. Add them to. Now that this is done, I've also uh, cooked the vermicelli noodles. Give it a quick toss. This pot over here. 
here is I'm gonna serve it in a glass bowl so that you can actually see all the layers and the components of this uh, pad thai. on top and garnish with some peanuts. <laughs> 